Anacelia de Armas. Casso, a name that resonates with talent and versatility, has carved her path from the streets of Havana, Cuba, to the glitzy boulevards of Hollywood. Born on April 30, 1988, Ana de Armas is a Cuban-Spanish actress whose journey in the entertainment industry has been nothing short of remarkable. De Armas spent her formative years in Cuba, raised in the quaint city of Santa Cruz del Norte. Despite the challenges posed by Cuba's special period, characterized by food rationing and electricity blackouts, her childhood was imbued with happiness. It was during this time that her love for acting blossomed. De Armas, who had limited exposure to popular culture beyond Cuba, honed her skills by memorizing and practicing monologues in front of a mirror. Her breakthrough came at the age of 14 when she auditioned successfully to join Havana's National Theater of Cuba. She exhibited remarkable talent, starring in several films during her time as a student. However, her aspirations led her beyond the confines of her homeland. At 18, armed with Spanish citizenship through her maternal lineage, she embarked on a journey to Madrid to pursue her dreams of becoming an actress. De Armas wasted no time in making her mark in the Spanish entertainment industry. She quickly landed roles in notable productions, including a leading role in the romantic drama Una Rosa de Francia, 2006. Her performance caught the attention of audiences and industry insiders alike, leading to more opportunities. One of her most significant roles came with the popular drama series El Internado, where she portrayed Carolina for six seasons from 2007 to 2010. The show's success catapulted de Armas to stardom, making her a household name in Spain. Despite her rising fame, she yearned for new challenges and decided to explore opportunities beyond Spanish borders. De Armas's transition to Hollywood was met with both excitement and challenges. Arriving in Los Angeles in 2014 with limited English proficiency, she embarked on a journey to conquer the competitive landscape of American cinema. Her determination and talent soon caught the attention of casting directors, leading to her English-speaking debut in Eli Roth's Knock Knock, 2015. While her early roles in Hollywood were met with mixed reviews, de Armas persevered, honing her craft and expanding her repertoire. She delivered notable performances in films such as War Dogs, 2016, and Hands of Stone, 2016, showcasing her ability to portray diverse characters with depth and nuance. However, it was her role as Joy in Denis Villeneuve's Blade Runner 2049 Inches, 2017, that catapulted her to international acclaim. Her portrayal of the holographic AI projection garnered widespread praise, solidifying her status as one of Hollywood's rising stars. Subsequent roles in films like Knives Out, 2019, further showcased her talent, earning her critical acclaim and accolades. De Armas' stellar performances have not gone unnoticed, earning her nominations for prestigious awards such as the Golden Globe and Academy Award. Her portrayal of Marilyn Monroe in Blonde, 2022, garnered particular acclaim, showcasing her range and depth as an actress. Beyond her professional achievements, De Armas' personal life has also been a subject of interest. Her relationships with high-profile figures like Ben Affleck have often made headlines, adding to her allure as a Hollywood star. As she continues to captivate audiences with her talent and charisma, Ana de Armas remains a shining example of resilience, determination, and passion in the world of entertainment. With a promising career ahead, she is poised to leave an indelible mark on the silver screen for years to come. Thank you for tuning in to today's video. I trust you found it insightful. Your feedback is invaluable, so please share your thoughts in the comments section below. If you enjoyed the content, don't hesitate to show your support with a thumbs up.